So, um, in response to this video, I've actually seen this um, this sermon before when I was I was younger. It was long. It's, uh, it's been a long time since I've seen this one. Um, so it was like I don't see it was like junior sophomore yeah, sophomore junior year of high school when I actually saw this uh, when I saw this sermon for the first time. Um, actually, I used to think this way. <laughs> I used to be I used to be influenced. Um, I thought a lot of my thought used to be influenced by um, by um, Reverend Hagee. Um, for a long time, actually, um, until until more recent, and when I've actually been learning a lot of the other side as well, um, a lot of the teachings from these um, these this this um, this series of John Hagee's, um, <laughs> yeah, they're not really. Um, a lot of the stuff he says, he says Allah doesn't forgive, and Islam is not a Islamic. Um, people of Islam, Muslims don't worship the same God as Christians and Jews, and <laughs> technically, you know, they do worship the same God because, you know, I mean, if even if you ask Arabic, you know, Arab, like Christians of Arab descent, and they'll say the name for God is Allah, still, you know, it's just the word, not really, you know, it, it means the same thing, it's the same God. Um, but, you know, they, there's a few concepts of Islam that don't really, they don't really believe in, like, that come from Christianity, like, um, people that Islam, they believe Jesus is a prophet, not necessarily the son of God, and they don't believe that he, he, you know, he was a divine, you know, he's a divine entity, he's a, they believe that he's a prophet, and, um, every time they mention Jesus, they'll say, um, you know, Jesus, peace be upon him, or, you know, they have something to that extent, but, um, yeah, this is, this is, um, now that I see this again, it's kind of, kind of outlandish to me. Um, it's very, very, <laughs> it's very upsetting, you know, because, um, a lot of what he's saying is just, it's, it's wrong. Um, but, I mean, I'm not, at the same time, I still have respect from a lot of the stuff he says. Some of the stuff he says is still, it's still good preaching. Um, but on Islam, yeah, I mean, he just didn't go attacking other religions like that. Um, just, just in my opinion. Uh, at the same time, uh, man, like, he should, I mean, he should try to make, you know, he should try to make peace with other religions instead of starting to, instead of just bashing them. And, you know, it's just, I don't understand. I don't understand what he's trying to get out, you know. He might have war and all this, uh, you know, crusade type your say type preaching man like now that I go over all of these sermons again I'm I'm just shocked at a lot of the stuff that Jesus taught I mean it's not like we have to you know like you know Jesus didn't teach go to war and kill people and you know he just he just taught love your love thy neighbor as yourself and you know and <laughs> care for uh, you know, care for people and you know not you know what would Jesus do John Hagee you know yeah whew crazy man but yeah I think that's all I wanted to say on this I mean um before you I mean after watching a John Hagee sermon you might want to do some research on the other side of the topic um just because your information might be a little bit more you know because you can have a lot of information coming from one side and it'd be like a one-sided you know one-sided intelligence I like to call it you know like you can be smart, but all of your concepts and ideas only come from one side of an argument, and they don't really come from both sides. So if you actually look at both sides of an argument, then that way you can actually get a better picture of actually how things actually are. Um, and, yeah, I mean, um, another, another uh, uh, thing I have is um, religious guys shouldn't be in politics. Yeah, I would seriously, can, you know, I don't like the idea of whole, the whole Reverend Wright and Obama and, uh, you know, and, and Reverend Hagee and, you know, it seems like, you know, you got this extreme left wing preacher, extreme right wing preacher, you know, putting God into politics like that, just, you know, it's not, it's not right, you should stick to what you, you know, stick to your guns, you know, stick to preaching God and get out of politics, you know, if you want to, if you want to go to politics, be a politician don't, you know, I'm not going to go to church to hear what you have to say in politics, you know, we can talk about that afterwards, we can do studies on that afterwards, 
and a lot of your politics, you know, can deal with your faith, but I don't want to go to church and hear all your politics and your anti-Islam and your anti-white and your anti, you know, anti-stuff, you know, it's not, no, I don't, I don't really feel that, um, yeah, I just, Actually, I mean, this is a shock to me now I'm watching this again. But, I mean, I've got to run because uh, I've got to go to dinner. But, um, I'm going to watch so many more of these videos later, probably. And I'll probably post some more comments. Make sure you guys... Just telling you guys, man, if you're ever watching a John Hagee, man, you want to do some research on the other side of the topic. And, I mean... Yeah. It's highly recommended. It's definitely far, far right. You know, it's con you know extremely conservative bias. Um, but yeah, that's it, so, so, that's all I got for you.